Well, Tim here brought me, called me up this morning, told me we have a cool clutch hatching. This is one of Tim's projects we I stuck them on. <laughs> these are uh, a pretty important clutch. I think these are from a regular het genetic stripe to a Sunfire het genetic stripe. So we're not going to have a lot of genetic stripes. But we're sure hoping for that magical, you know, one of a kind rare snake that we we've, we've got three of, but we're pretty excited about. And uh, they look really good. We just anyway, we're going to cut them. This one here is already cut. Tim said he cheated and peaked, and it is a genetic stripe. First one to cut was a genetic stripe, but he doesn't think it's Sunfire. We've already seen one. So we know what they look like. They're pretty, pretty awesome looking snakes. And <laughs> he's looking over there. And it's a normal, straight up genetic stripe. See the nice silver sides? That gets replaced with red. <laughs> we'll just pick on this big fat one over here. Woo! Big ol'. Ho ho! Man, that's amazing. We had two in a row. Oh, it is the right one. One out of 16. Look at the color on that one. And the stripe. <laughs> oh, man. That is awesome. First two eggs, genetic stripes. That might be the last two in the whole clutch. It's only one out of 16. And that's, and so we, woo, that's awesome. Oh my gosh! Another genetic stripe! It's a normal. That's incredible. Three genetic stripes. Sunfire. Smoke and sunfire. Look at the, the sunfire is incredible in this clutch because of the genetic stripe. It just, see that's probably a het genetic stripe we think because it has, they, genetic stripes look a little different. So, you know, when we're breeding them, we notice that the, the het genetic stripes have more color. Oh, there's another beautiful sunfire. Look at the tail on that thing. Okay, here, we got a lot of eggs. <clears throat> so, these eggs took how many days, Tim, to hatch? 80 days. These were 80 days and they slit. Whoa! Another sunfire genetic stripe. Woohoo! pretty cool when you get a lucky chance to be the first one to produce something and and you're able to do well with it before any before they're even out so it's kind of nice so we already got we already got two uh, sunfire genetic stripes two normals and they're normals too Another one. So at 80 days, another normal. Man, well, we're lucky. So far, we've done really well with the odds. Well, it doesn't matter how. Oh, another genetic stripe. Normal. Genetic stripe, that is. 25% should be genetic stripe. Sunfire. Another sunfire. Of course, these are only possible het genetic stripes, but I still think we can tell. Oh, there's a nice genetic stripe. Wow, beautiful. It's a normal genetic stripe, but a beautiful one at that. Nice open back pattern. We got our odds. We, we got everything we could dream of already. There's a nice sun sunfire. Looks a little bit more traditional sunfire, unlike this one over here or the other one we just looked at. Oh, some of these eggs are tough. That's why I put my finger in there. There's a normal. Okay, let's see here. Oh, 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 oh. Sunfire. A uh, sunfire. Just a crazy sunfire. One of those really good looking ones. So tell me, what do you guys want to see on videos? I think Tim ought to videotape some of the breeding. What do you guys think? Post on this video and tell me how much we want to see what we want to see most. This takes a while here to cut all these, but 
It's like Christmas. We might get something really neat out of them. That's why it's fun to watch to the last one. That one clutch we had crazy stuff in. Ooh, there's a beautiful Sunfire. That's one of the first times in, that we cut and got one of a one out of 16 in the first egg. Oh, look at that Sunfire. Normal. Possible hat. Oh, these eggs are tough. Beautiful Sunfire. Okay, here. Let's see what we got here. A normal, big fat normal. You guys had a chance to watch the webisodes? Check us out at Prehistoric Pets TV YouTube. That's where we do all our uploads of our videos now. And we have a show called The Reptile Zoo. And uh, it's a little bit of everything. We got some really good episodes coming up. They come up, we put them out every every Monday. If you look, we actually get them out Sunday night usually. I'm trying to hurry here, seeing if we're gonna get to some jackpots. This is a big clutch. We're real happy with this this clutch, and we've already got our we've already got what we hope to get out of it. Whoa! Look at that snake. Hmm. An annery, an annery sunfire. It's like a wow. That is a wild snake. Ha! Huh, see, there's always something weird around here. Dang, it's a little small. I hope it makes it, because it is a cool snake. Wow, that is cool. We'll have to do some updated stuff on that. It looks a little bit small, but man, it has got insane gray. It's like a, it's like a, hard to explain. A melanistic sunfire. Wow, I hope that makes it. That is cool. Can you imagine we could reproduce that, Tim? That is crazy. We got just a few eggs left. Come on, one more for good luck. Nah, we're good. Look at the, look at the color that on that one. Beautiful. Is that that looks like one of the best ones we've ever seen. This one's really a little bit dried out, but he's in there. Oh, Sunfire. We did very well. Two, two Sunfire genetic stripes already. Maybe that's all we got. That's as good as we could have hoped for. And we're kind of really one up already. Wow. Normal. The normal striped. Nice one. Really striped. So this is it. There we go. I think I got them all. Yeah, I think you did. So look at this, guys. Check this. Check this out. Look at that snake. Wow. That is impressive. And they only color up, so that thing's going to be beautiful. So we got some beautiful snakes, and this thing is just bizarre. <clears throat> it's like a total annery. It is just really something else. So we'll see how it does. Take care, guys. Hope you had to enjoy this video, and uh, tell us what you want on the next ones. We'll try to make some more. Make this, make this guy do some breeding videos. Yeah, we'll get on it. <laughs> Take care, guys.